Good day, learners. So today we'll discuss about parts and functions of microscope. At the end of this lesson, you will be able to describe the parts of the microscope and its functions. First, we have the ocular or eyepiece. The lens of the viewer looks through to see the specimen and usually contains a 10 times or 15 times power lens. A specimen is anything that we view under the microscope. Next is body tube. It connects the eyepiece to the objective lenses. Course adjustment knob. It moves the body tube up and down to focus the image. It is also used for initial focusing. Revolving nose piece. Attached to the base of the body tube, it holds and facilitates the shifting of objective lenses. Objective lenses. It focuses and magnifies the specimen. It contains two objective lenses. Low power objective is marked 10 times or 12 times, while high power objective is marked as 40 times, 43 times, or 60 times. If the longest objective is marked as 97 times or 100 times, or OIO, then it has an oil immersion objective that is used to view bacteria, very small proteins, and fungi. Next is fine adjustment knob or fine focus. It is the smaller knob for slow or little movement when focusing on the high power objective and gets a sharper focus of the specimen. Next is arm. It serves as a handle and connects the base and the body tube. Inclination joint. A movable hinge that attaches the frame of the microscope to the base. It is used for tilting or inclining the microscope. Stage. A platform that holds and supports the slide with the specimen is placed. Stage clips. It holds the slide in place on the stage. Mirror. Produces light that passes through the diaphragm. Base. It supports the entire microscope. Diaphragm. Found under the stage. It controls the amount of light passing through the specimen. So that's it. Thank you for watching. Like, share, and subscribe.